Today I want to talk to you about some breaking news I have just seen, and that is the fact that Fat Shark are joining forces with Rotor Riot and they are going to become part of Red Cat Holdings. Now, Fat Shark have been a long established FPV goggles and FPV system manufacturer. However, when we moved to digital just over a year ago, DJI very much caught the market off guard and released the digital FPV system, which has become the market leader for digital FPV. Whilst Fat Shark did release a digital system called Bite Frost at the same time, it was very much a beta product and it was nowhere near as polished or finished as the DJI system. Now, since the release of the DJI FPV, they really have been pushing it forward. They've been releasing regular firmware updates and it has been showcased in many places, including heavily showcased on Rotor Riot. DJI have been producing videos with them. They've been sponsoring content as well as advertising with them as well. Now, today's news really does change things. And just to show you what has actually been said, if we head over to the Fat Shark Facebook page, you can see that there is a post stating that they are excited to become part of Rotor Raya as part of Red Cat Holdings. Now, Red Cat Holdings are the parent company of Rotor Riot, and they acquired it just over a year ago now, if I recall. And they own another a number of companies relating to drones, Rotor Riot, Drone Box, etc. Today, though, they have now acquired Fat Shark, and Fat Shark is going to become part of their portfolio. Now, the interesting thing about this is whilst DJI clearly have the better product today, what this has just done is very much slam shut a door for advertising purposes for the FPV system. Fat Shark have really struggled with bite frost. However, they are not down and out and their new shark bite system, which is based off bite frost, is just around the corner. And whilst DJI have been able to capitalize on using Rotor Riot to push sales, that door has literally just been slammed closed. And the reality is Rotor Riot are going to be concentrating on what Ever Fat Shark intends to make because they are all now part of the same company. Now, this makes things very interesting because whilst usually we expect the best technology to win, the reality is that isn't always the case. There is no question that the DJI digital FPV system is by far the best digital FPV system of all of them right now. However, if DJI are not able to actually advertise it like they were before, Fat Shark are going to get a massive jump up just through the fact that they are now part of Rotor Riot. Now, the other interesting aspect around this is DJI have been actually doing a huge amount of sponsorship and advertising with Rotor Riot over the last 12 months. It does make you wonder if uh, Red Cat have been putting all of that money to one side to use it to actually buy Fat Shark. And whilst there has been little rumblings about Fat Shark possibly getting sold to someone, I was personally not expecting it to be Rotor Riot themselves. It's an extremely clever move and it is one that is certainly going to help drive Fat Shark forward regardless of if it's the best product or not. They will now have access to that massive Rotor Riot community. If we take a look at just the YouTube channel here and now, they have over 200,000 subscribers. They have their website, their blogs, as well as their other content as well. And that is a massive audience that is going to be available to Fat Shark on tap, unlike they've had before. Now, whilst on the face of this, it looks quite bad for DJI, reality could be very different. Fat Shark have been developing their own digital FPV system, but it hasn't come easily. And Fat Shark have openly said that they are primarily a goggles manufacturer and their intention with Bite Frost or Shark Bite alongside DiviMath was to provide an open HD standard for manufacturers to use, including Fat Shark. We know DJI have developed their own FPV system in house and they have started to work with other partners as well. There is a strong relationship between DJI and Rotor Riot, and Rotor Riot are even a DJI official dealer 
for the digital FPV system. Now that the Fat Shark have become under the umbrella the same as Rotor Riot, it is not beyond belief to think that you could actually see a bit of a relationship form between the three companies. And could we see Fat Shark goggles with integrated DJI digital FPV in the future? And whilst Fat Shark are using that DiviMath system, there is nothing to say that will continue. And the reality is, whilst DJI have done very well with their current goggles and their current system, they are not perfect for everybody. And if they do want their system to expand, they're going to need to work with some pretty serious partners. And the biggest one of them is Fat Shark. So it's not beyond the possibility that this whole deal could actually benefit everyone and not actually single out DJI to the side while Fat Shark and Rotoriot head off into the sunset. The reality is it is a Game of Thrones and we're going to have to see who actually ends up sitting in the chair in the end. It's going to make a very interesting 6 to 12 months, that is for sure. Now that is it for this video. I hope the information provided is useful. If you do find it interesting, please do hit that subscribe button. There are links to the DJI Digital FPV system in the description of this video as well if you would like to support the channel too. Finally, I do a live stream on a Sunday night on my dedicated live stream channel. There is a link to that in the description of this video as well. It would be fantastic to see some of you guys along on that one too.